Hi guys, welcome to my crazy life. It's Lori and I have an Easter candy haul for you. I'm so excited to share with you a bunch of candies that I picked up at the Dollar Tree and I wanted to share them with you and Alex and Wellington want to help us. Right, baby? He said yes. All right, let's get started. I have some packaged stuff and then some individually packaged stuff. So I wanted to show you some of the individually packaged stuff and what I did with it. These eggs here hold quite a bit of candy. I was pretty surprised. So I have these eggs that I have filled up. I'm reaching. As well as these eggs. Now these are great. They come apart, but you, they have a whole, um, you can hang them. Like I can hang them on the garland behind me. I'm getting ready to start with Easter, but the sun was over there. So I'm over here. Hi babies. So this is, um, these are going to be in Sarah's Easter baskets. I had a couple eggs left from the kids. So I just filled them for her. Um, so let's get started on what I found. We'll start with the stuff that I've already opened and put into containers because it'll be easier that way. So I got the carnival pops and these are in the Easter colors. They have the bunny and oh my goodness, are they adorable. The round one is in the shape of an Easter egg and then they have the unicorn as well. You get eight little lollipops individually packaged, which I think is fantastic for a dollar. And then I grabbed the assorted fruit Tootsie Rolls. You get a fair amount in there and they just come in the dip, you know, just like a regular Tootsie Roll. And these come with orange, lime, lemon, cherry, and vanilla. And they're just kind of fun, I think. I love the colors. And again, I love that they're individually packaged. This is something I don't know that I've ever seen there, but it's a little package of the Reese eggs, but look how cute these eggs are. They are. I don't know if this is, I don't buy a lot of candy, so I don't know if this is a normal size or if it's a little size, but it's a little, you know, just a Reese's egg. I think you get 12 in here. I cut off the, the serving thing, but it's a small bag. Price point, you know, if you have a lot of kids or you want a lot of candy, this is not your best bet. I just have a few things to purchase, so this is great for me. And I don't know that I've ever seen those there. Um, they had a pack of Airheads. And again, they're individually packaged and these fit right inside. I just did that and they fit right inside of the eggs. And this one comes with watermelon, blue raspberry, and then the white mystery flavor. Um, you get 12 bars. So again, perfect size, especially if you only have like one or two little ones and you want to get them a variety or older people or whatever. Um, they came back out with their sixlets and you get 25 packages in here. And if you don't know what a sixlet is, they're just little like ball shaped M&Ms. And I bet you these will work in the Dollar Tree gumball machine because I will tell you the M&Ms were too big. So I'm going to try this next and see. I kept one out for that purpose. And then I grabbed for everybody and each person got one of these. It's just the, um, the lemon chocolates. I don't even know if it's like white chocolate. I'm going to go with that. It's white chocolate. Yeah, it's like a white fudge. Lemon flavored. So everybody got one of those. And I just think that's the perfect amount. So that was everything that, oh no, lies. Um, and then they had packages of Starburst. Now they also had the bags of just the pink, but I got the variety. This one comes with all different, but there's like East, not Easter. It's like Halloween candy. You get two of them in each. So that was fun. And those also fit in those eggs. And most of the stuff I got was name brand because you know, we all know they sell Palmers, but let's find some better stuff. I'm not a huge Palmers fan. Um, but speaking of Palmer, do you remember the mix from Christmas? They came out with Easter. What? And this has little um, Easter shapes with peanut butter in the middle, peanuts and pretzels. It's just a little snack mix. Oh, 
And I think Sarah really liked it at Christmas time, so I got her an Easter one. Oh, this is from Target, but I get her one of these every year. It's the Reese PC carrots. And I'm gonna tell you, these things over the years have gotten smaller and smaller, but the price is not. I think these are like 88 cents, but I get her one every year, so that was important. This box is actually empty because I dumped them in the gumball machine trying to see if it would make it work. It doesn't. These are just the pastel, regular old M&Ms. So we'll throw that away. And then I got Sarah the M&M peanut butter eggs. I love these. I, I, who doesn't like chocolate and peanut butter, right? So I grabbed some of those. Oh, I'm putting stuff in the bag over here because then I can put all of my Easter candy away and I'm done with the Easter baskets. Oh, and these are the bags I bought in the party section. And look, I just filled them full of eggs and candy. And then closer to Easter, I'll put the fake grass down in there and maybe some other little treats for the kids. But I love these bags. I think they're perfect. And these were not in the Easter section, they were in the party section. Okay. Um, look at these guys. How about, no, yes, double bubble bubblegum eggs. Though these are gonna go to the kids, not Sarah. She has TMJ, I don't think she would enjoy that. So I may need to get some more Easter eggs for the kids stuff. And then on the front of the kids, I also found, look at these, they're blow pops without the stick. They're just little mini hard candies with gum in the middle, but I grabbed two, one for each of my little cousins in these little packages because I think they are adorable. And they come in watermelon, blue raspberry, cherry, and sour apple, and they're resealable, just little pouches. I mean, how fun is that for somebody's Easter basket? Right? Right. And they had one more color. We need a thumbnail. Y'all, I'm so cheesy. Um, I found, and if you want these, you need to get into that store quickly. The Russell Stover's, this is milk chocolate. I don't know if these are hollow or solid, to be honest with you. It doesn't say, but this is 1.3 ounce and this is 1.5 ounce. And this is the peanut butter bunny. So I got her a regular bunny and a peanut butter bunny. They're little. And it's Russell Stover. And Russell Stover is a good brand. But these go fast at my stores. Like, I don't even think I saw any of the milk chocolate ones left at one of my stores. Um, I grabbed her some of the Godiva chocolate domes. So they are truffles with, um, I would say they're like a Lindor truffle, if I had to guess. But this is Godiva. Again, Godiva is a name brand. It's expensive and it's good quality Belgium chocolate. So I grabbed her those for my Sarah, cause she needs them. I also got her a Russell Stover Pecan Delight. I've not seen these before at my store. And there is one, one bar in here and it's pecan pieces and creamy caramel enrobed in luscious milk chocolate. Doesn't that sound delicious? Almost like a turtle. So I grabbed that for her. For my cousin Debbie, she gets Mambo's cause she likes these. Um, and they sell them there. And this is the um, strawberry, orange, and raspberry. Oh, lemon, raspberry, orange, and strawberry. And I know they have a tropical one as well. They're like an hour later. Um, but those are for Cousin Debbie. I picked up for Sarah. These are Haribo. They're the, hoppy, how, the happy hoppers. And they're just gummy. You know, that's the, like the gummy bears, but they're shaped like bunnies. I mean cute is that guys um I got some junior mint eggs for her because they're just cute guys I really can't handle this cuteness factor that we have going on here um I know she loves these mug cakes so I'm gonna give her one of those these are fantastic any time of year any holiday Christmas especially give somebody a mug and a mug cake and this even comes with the frosting so that is pretty exciting. I know we've all seen them, but I think she loves those. Now, I found the Pero, the Paperos, which is the Korean version of a Pocky stick. Pockies. Um, this one is the almond chocolate biscuit. And this one is white chocolate, cookies and cream, and almond chocolate. 
So I thought this is fun. Like I love get finding treats that are international, you know, something we don't see all the time. So I grabbed her two of those. And then the last, oh, nope. I got her some cotton candy peeps. I don't even know if she likes peeps, but you gotta have the cotton candy ones and it is Easter, right? And then the last thing I picked up for her was three bags of M&Ms. And I love that these are just little M&Ms. You know, they're, it's more than a one serving, but it certainly isn't a large bag. So I got her the Starburst um, Sweet Tart, because she loves jelly beans. Sweet Tart, and now and later. And again, they're, they're small, you know? So if you had a couple kids, you could each get them each one and they could share or fight over them. I don't know. But that is it for the Easter candy that I purchased this year at the Dollar Tree. And I hope you have a good luck finding them as well. All right, guys, that was what I purchased for the Happy Easter candy at my Dollar Tree. Have a good one. Bye.